gotta get up. What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy, not your most, and your host, Wanted. Guys, I'm going to be teaching you how to download WinRaw for free and the complete full version. WinRaw itself costs $28, but in this case, I'm going to give you for free and make you save $28. So, guys, you may be asking to yourself, what is WinRaw and what is it used for? Well, at first, I did not understand WinRaw, so I used to delete it and download it again. But once I understand it is to download files. Now, once you download files, it's basically when you download files and you can open your files. So when you download files and you can open your files, I'm just deleting that for a second. When you can't download and open your files, that's where your WinRaw comes in handy. So first thing what you really want to do, guys, you want to press the start button on your desktop you want to go over to computers you want to right click on computers go to properties open properties now you want to scroll down to see system type 64-bit operation system or system type 32-bit operation system now you want to remember this number so for instance my number is 64 if your number is 32 you remember 32 so i know mine is 64 so now once you have your number all you really want to do, guys, you want to go over and see, open this page. This will be down in the description. It's going to call it WinRaw File. You want to open this page. Now, whatever language you speak, you want to click on your language. So, I'm a, I speak English. Now, whatever bit you had, which mine was 64, you choose 64. Now, if you speak English and you have 32, you click 32. But for instance, mine is 64, so I'm going to click 64. Now this is going to say, it's, this is going to harm your computer. All you really want to do, you want to press keep. This actually does not harm your computer. Any file I give you does not harm your computer. I am running this on a laptop. So this actually, if it harms your computer, it will actually harm my computer. Which, that would not be a great thing. But, remember this will not harm your computer. This will actually help your computer. So now once you have that guys, all you really want to do, you want to press the start button on your, keep on your thing. And then you want to go to documents. Once you go to documents, you want to go to downloads. Now you want to look for WinRaw 64 or WinRaw 32. That's one way of looking at it. The second way of looking at it is the easier way. There's an arrow right next to it. You want to press show in folder. Now once you see show shows in folder, you want to exit out of this. And now you could you drag this out of you could drag this out of your um out, out to your desktop or you could right click on it. And press create a shortcut, and that's gonna then after when you create a shortcut, it's gonna pop up something on your screen. So I'm just gonna so once you create a shortcut, you wanna drag it out your to your desktop, and once you have a shortcut, all you really want to do, you wanna click on it. So now when you click yes, guys, all you really want to do, you wanna click install. Now once you install it, you wanna create it to a desktop. Which when you create it to a desktop, you add it here, and when you create it to your start menu, it creates it right here. Then you wanna check I ISO and jar if you want to or not you can leave it unchecked but I would like to I like to check it then you click OK and then you click done and now as you see you have WinRaw outside of here already so now to drag WinRaw out you can just do this also and then drag WinRaw out or Another way, another way you could do this is, I'm just gonna, you could press start, type in WinRaw, which this is the harder way, and drag WinRaw out. So now, as you see, there's plenty of ways how to do it, but I'm just gonna, I already have one WinRaw out, so it doesn't, it, it's no need for two. But as you see, both of them, as you see when I open one of them, they're both the same. So basically, it brings up all your files, and when you open this one up, it brings up all your files also. So guys, now I'm gonna exit out of that. And now once I exit out of that, this where this where this is where WinRaw comes in handy. So you may be saying, how do you use WinRaw? I'm gonna show you how to use it. So for instance, I have a download file. I'm a, I have this file right here that I want to use it. I'm gonna right click on this file. I'm actually double click on this file, and when I double click on this file, it's gonna bring me an error message, or a paint can read this file, something error message. You wanna click OK. So you wanna right click on it, you're gonna open with. 
you want to open with Winner Achiever. Now you can use it from here and do this step, but to not take the hassle and go to WinRaw, open it with WinRaw, you want to click Extract It To. Now you can extract it to your desktop, which is here, or you can extract it to any folder you want, which I'm extracted to my desktop. And as you see, I already have one, so I'm going to click Yes to replace it. I'm going to click Yes to replace. And this will take to a good 10 to 5 seconds to download. So as you see, mine is going pretty quick. And remember, I am recording. So now once it's that doing that, you can just exit out of that and exit out of that. And now you should have your file. Now once you cl double click on your file, and once that's done, you should have your file over here and you're all set to go. So guys, if you enjoyed that video and you want to know another how-to video on how to on how to do any type of how-tos, for instance, how to get Minecraft crack, how to get XSplit full version, how to get anything, how to get Adobe, it doesn't matter. Anything I know how to do. And guys, if you want any of that, remember to leave down in the comment section, what do you want me to do next, guys? And if you liked, if you enjoyed this video, remember to leave a like, comment, rate, and subscribe. And well, you know what I do at the end. And it's your boy Nwasi for the win. And I'm out.